It is Tuesday, November 14th. This is Chris Jenkins with your Charlotte Hornets weekly update. And I'm gonna tell you guys, we're not gonna talk too much about last week because sometimes last week isn't so good. And I'm a guy just likes to get things right and move ahead. So last week after our video, Hornets went 0-2 with the most painful loss for me being that game against the Boston Celtics where they seemed in command of that game, had a lead in that game, and they ended up losing that game, all right? So I'm just gonna move forward and talk about some of the good things that are happening tomorrow. One of them being the return of Nick Batum. He's been out for quite some time. He will be returning tomorrow as a starter for the team, and Coach Clifford said that he will be monitoring his minutes. Not too sure yet of how many minutes, because he needs to talk to the trainer, but Nick is also gonna have the freedom to you know, raise his hand up and say, hey, I gotta come out, I need a breather. Because one thing that uh, Coach Clifford wants to do is he wants to get him back into the lineup immediately because his team needs to boost from the losing streak that they're on. So he wants them to get into that rhythm as soon as possible, but he has to be mindful that they have seven games in the next 11 days and there's no need to rush this guy back and you know mess up anything as far as having another injury the other thing that's exciting about tomorrow if you're an old hornets fan love the pinstripes remember the guy the, the days of playing at the coliseum they will be back in those pinstripe uniforms tomorrow and i will be there covering the game so if you'd like to see those photos of that and lots of coverage for that tomorrow just make sure you follow me on all social <coughs> excuse me on any of the social media, everything is at Charlotte Vibe, whether you're Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, whatever. You can follow me on there and stay up to date with this team. So that is it for now. Uh, I will be at the game. Talk to me. I like to say I work for you guys. If there's anything that I have not talked about that you want to hear about, just let me know. And I also have interviews with some of the rookies that are coming up. Now that we got this home stand, we can schedule that so you guys have that to look forward to. Thanks so much for watching.